Hello ladies and gentlemen, one short video that I'm making quickly to solve a problem that some students have shown me about this version of Apex. Let me read the exact version. It was apparently Oracle 20.2. The new icons look very nice and much greener, but when trying to build an application, this is what happens. So I click on the App Builder, I choose create an app. The way that new applications are made has changed a little with this new version, so check the details. I choose new application and by default as you can see there will be a home page and there's a few options. Let's give a name to the application. App test March 2021 and I'm going to leave the defaults and press create. Okay, I now have a space for my application. There is a home page which is in there by default and I can run it straight away. All there is is home page, so it's not going to show very much, but still, you know, let's go for it and an error. When you run it like this, you can just switch back to the application editing by going to the tab there. So this is the application or the error. This is the application editing. We can add new pages, we can change existing ones, all of that sort of thing. So how do we resolve this? I searched for information about this so and if someone has encountered it already, you can see here 404 not found error, Oracle Apex and a screenshot that looks very much like the problem that we're encountering is and they say here I have started learning Apex I installed this I'm getting this error and as I scroll down I find two people have replied one explains something to do with user permissions and that sort of uh, and that sort of thing but then someone else saying I had a similar issues try this untick friendly urls and then run it again we might be able to do something about it it's worth testing so i return to my application builder in the application properties there it is edit application properties and hopefully there will be some options in there right name of my application the alias for it uh, things like which version and all sorts of things and I scroll down yes yeah, there it is there's a thing here that says friendly URLs and I, that looks green it's at look it looks like it's on in fact no friendly URLs home pages in you know, well, the RDS access and then there's my I want to show you the whole URL the username and then application test March 2021 so the application has a, a nice address that's what they talk about with the friendly URL apparently if I turn off the friendly URL let's turn it off okay it's great press apply changes press run and right it asks me for a username and a password And yes, there's the application. Okay, it's not a very exciting application. All I've got in that application is a home page, remember? You know, a home, a global page for the desktop, a login page. There must be better applications than this, but it's working. There's no 404 error. I can actually start editing this. So the problem was to reiterate, go to edit application properties, untick the friendly URLs, it's those friendly addresses that are really not working. 